Topeka. My name is Juan Underbaki, and I live in Tampa, Florida. Today, I'll be reading Mother Bruce by Ryan Higgins. Hey. Bruce was a bear who lived all by himself. He was a grump. He did not like rain. He did not like sunny days. He did not like cute little animals. Bruce only liked one thing, eggs. He collected them from all over the forest. Good morning, Miss Sparrow. But Bruce didn't eat eggs raw like other bears. Instead, he, all, he cooked them into fancy recipes that he found on the internet. One day, Bruce came across a recipe for hard boiled goose eggs drizzled with honey, salmon sauce. So he went out to get the ingredients. First, he caught a few salmon. Then he collected honey from a local beehive. He liked to support local businesses, you see. Last, he went to Miss Goose's nest to pay her a visit. Are these eggs free range organic? At home, Bruce prepared the eggs for hard boiling, but the fire in his stove fizzled so he went out to get more wood. When Bruce came back, he was met with an unwelcome surprise. Mama, Mama, Mama! Bruce became the victim of mistaken identity. Bruce wanted hard boiled eggs, not gooselings. He supposed he could settle for buttered gooselings on toast. But for some reason, he lost his appetite. Bruce scooped up the little geese and stomped back to their nest. I will have to ask Miss Goose about her return policy. Be back in April. Only to find Miss Goose had flown south early. Bruce left the gooselings there anyway and went back home. Mama? Mama? But he was followed. Bruce was very stern and said things like, Go away! And I am not your mother. And also, I liked you better when you were eggs. Bruce could take it no longer and became extra grumpy with them. Roar! It didn't work. Gooselings always follow their mother, even if she is a he, and he is a bear. Bruce was stuck with him. He tried to make the best of it. It was hard work. Black, ew, yuck. And they all napped on a log. As the seasons pass, Bruce watched the pesky gooselings grow older. Annoying baby geese, stubborn teenage geese, boring adult geese. Then one fall afternoon, he saw other goose families flying south. Finally, he'd be rid of those geese and he could take a long winter nap. Bruce explained migration but they didn't listen. Bruce needed the geese to leave, so he got creative. Nothing worked. The geese would not leave Bruce. <sighs> so Bruce 
decide to pack some bags and take these geese into town. They boarded a bus and migrated to Miami, Florida. Now, every winter, Bruce and his geese head south together. They laze about at the beach in tacky shirts, sipping ice cold lemonade, while Bruce dreams of new recipes. Recipes that don't hatch. Mama? Thank you for joining us this evening, Vika. My name was Juan, and I was reading to you my